women. Women are so goddamn beautiful. You know why? Women don't fart. They poop. Poop. Excuse me. I made it smelly. Nah, bitch, I think you shit. God motherfucking Four, damn. Three, two, one. So you got your, uh, you know, your infamous catchphrase, God motherfucking damn. Did that come from yeah. somewhere? God motherfucking damn. 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 Damn! God motherfucking damn, bitch! God motherfucking damn! God motherfucking damn! God motherfucking damn! God motherfucking damn! Yeah, it just comes from within. Whatever within the mouth speaketh. That's what one thing that the scriptures say. As a man speaketh, so he is. And I is what I, I am, what I am. Now, when I do this Instagram shit, it's for me. I'm doing this for me to keep me happy, keep me going. It's not no shit no roller coaster some kind of fame bullshit that i'm on i just do what i like to do if i decide to post something or repost it, i do what the fuck i want to do and can't none bitch tell me nothing now see what the bitch just did big girl dropped some goddamn quarters man and i'm sitting on a milk crate in front of the store right so she bent down with her ass all in my face then she turned around got the pussy all up in my face i said bitch how old are you the bitch said she was 17. I said, you need to back up, bitch. Because my name is Chester Stone. Not R. Kelly, motherfucker. Because I'm 57 years old. And you only live once. So you have to make the trip that you live good. So I used to fuck up and do a lot of negative things. And I have to catch up from the negative and catch up and make more positivity in my life. This is why I post Things to encourage people, especially the young people, instead of telling them bullshit all the time. Now, black on black crime is a motherfucker, dog. Black lives matter, especially when another black person killed another black person. I'm going to start protesting that. When another black man kills another black man, black lives matter is going to protest that. That means we're going to have to be out there, bitch, every day. But if you don't want to protest that, I'm going to open up this. Chester Stone, funeral home for you dumb motherfuckers killing each other. God motherfucking damn. Black on black crime has got to stop. Blacks killing blacks. My way make a profit, bitch. Sorry to say, but it's the truth. Protest that motherfucker. You're at 150K, you go up about 2K a day. That's got to no, feel weird, me, right? Sir. Let me ask you, man. No, no, it don't feel weird. It is what it is, bitch. Yeah. It is what it is. See, we're living in a time that are real crucial right now. And people need relief, man, from the bullshit that's going on. Michael Jackson! Michael motherfucking Jackson! Hee hee! Hee hee! That nigga got skills! God motherfucking damn! Look at this nigga! That nigga got skill, bitch! Oh shit! God damn, nigga! I was going down to Captiva, Florida with my girlfriend and her family for a week. And I was looking at the drive and I was like, this goes through Tampa Bay. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm going to stop and see Chester. And at this point I had ordered one of his shirts from chesterstone1.com, the uh Chest I don't know, Chesterstone Worldwide or something. And so I was like, I'm going to bring that, I'm going to wear it. And we pull up to the gas station, we find Chester and I'm like, "Chester, look at the shirt I'm wearing." And just like the first time, he's freaking out. He's like, whoa. He takes me around on a tour of the whole block to the Metro, <laughs> to the Crump Man, where he gets his CDs made All right. and everything else. To the scenes, to the Aliana's Meat Market, he introduced me to Rose. He's like, Rose, look at my Caucasian nephew. Look at the shirt he's wearing. And I'm like, thank you, Chester. And so he gives me a CD. He, makes that he made a video of me and my girlfriend. And we went down. 
to get to you for the week. And we came back up. And I was like, of course I'm going to stop to see Chester again. Why would I not? So I stop again. I'm like, Chester, what's up? And again, he's just elated. He just <laughs> loves the fan connection. God motherfucker, damn! They bitches look like they from Georgia! God motherfucker, damn! Hey, make some room for me! I want to go to Georgia! Do hey, I want to go to Georgia! Hey, can I get a ride for Georgia? Can you make some room for me? Huh? Oh, God bless you! Hop in! I'm going to Georgia! All right, who's the number one Instagram in Tampa Bay in the world? You an intelligent Caucasian! And one week he did 10,000 followers. So he was 143 last week. And then um, this week he's 153. By the end of the day, I know he's going to be 154 because I've already patterned. I've watched the pattern of his followers. It's about 15 to 2,000 a day damn. on a good day. That's false. So he's going up. God motherfucking damn. Honey, kid in Newport, bitch. In a trash can. God motherfucking damn super D all like Donkey Kong. God damn. Newport's in the motherfucking house. Newport's bitch. Now, if I had a million or two dollars, I would open up after school programs for the kids that they can have extracurriculum so they can be something in life, bro. I don't know. Money don't, I'm not a materialistic person. So if I get millions of dollars, Half or more, or seventy percent of my money is going to help the children in the next generation. That's just from my heart. I'm not a materialistic ass person, right? right. Now, when I die, am I gonna take it with me? I'm gonna take it with me. Oh God, I need to take all the gold and the iron. Fuck that bitch. <laughs> Got to help the next generation so they can be successful and don't make the same mistakes that I made in my life, and that would make me happy. Yeah, I'm from time, man. Yeah. Thank you.